hey y'all welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm doing a cranberry look so to get started i'm using the milk makeup hydro grip primer i'm also gonna go in and do my brows first so i'm using the nars soft matte concealer and all the colors and things will be in the description box below but i'm just using the southern butte liquid lipstick the color is fearless just to do my brows and i did carve them out so this is a Morphe concealer. I'm gonna use that to kind of even out my eyelid and just give something for the liquid lipstick and the eyeshadow to stick to. I'm using the same liquid lipstick and that's just gonna be the base color for the eyeshadow look. So I'm just blending out that liquid lipstick And I'm going in with the Warrior 2 palette by Juvia's Place, and I'm using that burgundy color. This is just going to set that liquid lipstick and just make it more vibrant. So I'm really just blending, making sure the edges are as soft as possible. I'm going in with this Natasha Denona liquid eyeshadow and the color will be in the description. I think it's Dog Bane, um, but this is supposed to be like a, like a shifting color. You can't really see it on camera, but in person it's so pretty. You can kind of see it, but I'm really just layering it on and I'm gonna go in with an eyeshadow by MAC. It was one of their holiday eyeshadows from a few years ago, but I'm just gonna layer on top of that liquid eyeshadow. And I'm also going back in with that burgundy just to blend in. So I'm going in with that liquid lipstick and I'm just going to line my top lid and kind of blend it in with that eyeshadow. So you can kind of see the color shift of that right here, it's so pretty. Yes, ooh. So I'm going back in with that concealer. Um, I don't know, I don't know why I didn't show the foundation. I'm pretty sure the foundation I used was the NARS Soft Matte. So I'm just making sure that concealer is blending because it is a little light. And I'm going back in with the foundation brush just to blend out that concealer. This is, I'm pretty sure, Cameroon Shade Stick from Juvia's Place. I'm just using that to contour. And I'm using that same color just to contour my nose. And I'm using an eyeshadow blending brush. So this is the Beauty Bakery, I guess it's called Flower. <laughs> but it's a setting powder. And um, the color is ca Cassava, I'm guessing. Or Cassava. <laughs> Pretty sure it's Cassava. Um, but I'm just using this eyeshadow brush to blend out that concealer and make sure I don't have any creases. And I'm actually adding a little bit more. And I'm gonna set it with that setting powder. This this baking powder is so good. I 
and I'm going in with this bronzer from Zoeva. I've been really obsessed with these bronzers. It's so good for my skin tone and like I really like an orangey bronzer and not necessarily like a gray toned one. I'm really just trying to warm my skin up as much as possible. So I'm using those colors as blush. Also, the lashes that I have on are Brooklyn Beauty and it's Cash Money stacked with Wifey. I don't know how that got missing as well, but I'm just blending that same burgundy color on the bottom of my waterline or lash line. And I'm using the Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced. I'm also using that same liquid lipstick for lip color this time. I just really wanted the color to, or the look to be very cohesive. And I wanted to show how you can use one product for more than one thing. So this is Supreme Highlighter by Zoeva. And I think it fits perfectly with this look. It's like a pinky color. And this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you want to. I'll see you guys in my next video.